uh, some other treatments that do have some promising evidence. One uh, group of treatments is called visual spatial motor treatments. And what these do is they do a form of the visual scanning treatment, that's the visual part, um, and, but then add spatial and motor aspects to that. So for some of them, it involves just movement of the left side of the body. And the idea behind this is that the right hemisphere of the brain must be engaged in order to create movement on the left side of the body. So you have activity within the right hemisphere, which may potentially spill over into the attentional circuits to increase the shift of attention over to the left. One specific form of visual spatial motor treatment is called the lighthouse strategy, in which you add in some imagery along with the scanning and the motor component. And so in this treatment, they talk about the function of a lighthouse and the movement of the lighthouse, where the light swings all the way from the left over to the right. And they encourage the patient to use that full head motion from the left over to the right as they're doing scanning treatments. They talk about the image of the lighthouse sweeping the beam of light all the way from the left to the right. And then they use those images and those strategies, the movement strategies, while they're doing scanning tasks. And there is some evidence that that treatment does have some effect, not only on neglect, but also on navigation throughout the environment. So some of the patients in their study are less likely to bump into doorways when they're navigating through the environment. <music>